where was that? Where did that come from? When did the idea get implanted? Okay, let's let's try this pro wrestling thing out. Um, to kind of sum up a little before I was like, let me go after this. So right after college, like I was working in television and radio. And even that I just didn't feel fulfilled in getting like a television and radio job um, out of college is very tough because it's a very competitive um, career path. And so but I decided, you know what, I'm going to leave all that. And I'm going to go to Dallas and I'm just going to start all over and just try to see what makes me happy. So like I literally was working like multiple jobs, like in sales and like whatever. And I was living in uptown Dallas and I lived there for a year. And I'm just someone who I always need to be working towards something. And I felt like when I was over there, I didn't have any goals. I didn't know what I wanted to do still. And so my lease was about to end and my parents were like, before you sign another lease, come home, figure it all out. So I go home and that's when I'm really just trying to like figure everything out. So I'm back home again after going to being gone since whatever age for four years of school, one year working there and then like another year working in Dallas and I'm back home again. I'm like, this isn't supposed to happen. Like I work hard to like be in my own space, <laughs> have my own career. And so there I am and um, just trying to figure everything out. Like I even contemplated going to grad school to pursue creative writing, but um, it, wrestling started to get popped up again, especially being back home. And so I remember one of my best friends, she known me since high school, like she always would hear me if I would mention it. She was always the one I'd mention it to. So we were back home and she just texted me one day like, I'm watching wrestling and I think you would be so great at this. And I'm like, I'm like, yeah, it is really cool, huh? And I'm just like, yeah. And then so I really started to think about it. But then I'm like, no, because that's not what I'm supposed to do. I need to find something that I'm supposed to do for my life. And then um, we went to dinner um, with my family. My parents and my little sister, they went on vacation somewhere. And I was like with my aunt's family. And um, my... Um, cousin's daughter was watching it and I was just watching it with her and I'm like this is so cool and he goes yeah I don't know why you never did that like he was pretty much saying like you're dumb <laughs> and I was like well I don't even know how to get into that and then he was like you know there's a wrestling school down the street it was Shawn Michaels Wrestling Academy and then he like started googling it and then so then my aunt starts going like yeah I went to high school with Shawn Michaels <laughs> <laughs> So now I'm just getting it all over the place from everybody. And I'm just like, is this like working out? And so he was like, look, so Rudy Boy Gonzalez is the trainer, blah, 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 blah. It says contact here. And I literally messaged him right then. And I was like, hey, I think I might be interested in coming in and like checking out the school. And um, he emailed me back right away. And he's like, okay, tryout is September 11th. Um, cardio wise, be ready. And I went September 11th and never left. <laughs>